Well, Lisa, uh, Snow White and the Huntsman is uh, a revisionist take on Snow White, and I'm not sure we needed this revisionist take on Snow White, although there's some ravishing things about it. I really liked Charlie's Theron's performance as the evil stepmother. I feel like she at least uh, really digs into the nightmare princess fantasy aspects of the material. The bottom line for me is that this movie is working so hard to appeal to the guy demographic as well as the girl demographic that it's kind of three movies at once. I found it sort of ponderous. I found it actually excitingly dark. I liked mm. I liked its darkness. I liked its sort of crazy feminist take. I mean the whole idea yeah, of I this, like that too. The whole idea of this is that women are only about their beauty and that as soon as you lose your youthful beauty you're of no use to anybody. And Charlize Theron, I agree with you completely. She does a great job. She really channels crazy mean. Well you know, I agree with everything you're saying. I, I thought Theron was terrific and one of the things is that it's such an over the top performance. Mm. She's playing kind of a feminist mommy dearest but it's a knowingly like a over witch. the top yes, performance yes. she's such a good actress that she's able to control these gigantic operatic emotions make them work um, I thought Kristen Stewart was fine, very sort of tremulous and waif-like in her she way. She very much you really, like we know her from Twilight, I That's think. right. You, you kind of believe in her as Snow White in the first half. It's in the second half where she has to become Joan of Arc meets Braveheart meets Katniss Everdeen that I felt she wasn't really up well, to the role. Well, there's something I want to talk to you about. Every movie that we're seeing where it's basically good but starts to drag for me is when it gets to CGI battle. There's always a scene that happens when they're charging and there are monsters. And this has happened, I feel, in a number of... Uh, Avengers, too. The, the battle scenes were not nearly as exciting as everything else. And for me, part of it is I look at it and I say, this is where the computers have come in. Well, it is about CGI, but it's also about the way that these scripts are conceived. Mm -hmm. Avengers, I want to be a big battle movie, and I enjoy that battle for that reason. This is Snow White, and so when it turns into a war epic and there are all these monsters and there's all these clanging sword flights... I I feel like part of the this, movie. I, yeah, I feel like they have not really carried through what the material was. Mm. And in that sense, I felt it was a compromised movie. It's very watchable. I did like some of the dark aspects of it. I love the dark but aspects of it. to tell you the truth, I found some of it um, a little tedious. Well, I found any time Charlize was being mean, the meaner the better. And I thought this is a great, nice, kind of acidic summer movie that's not sweet. And for me, that works for the summer.